is gonna be better. Woo! There it goes, okay. Hello guys, what's going on? Melissa Miller, AKA Melissa Backwoods, coming at you from my home with uh, hanging out with Delilah right there. Yeah. Anyway, happy National Knife Day. Quite yet, but National Knife Day is coming um, October, August 24th. Anyway, Wee Knife got a hold of me and they wanted to do a video for National Knife Day. I was like, heck yeah, let's do it. Um, and when I asked them, well, what knives, what knives would you like me to talk about? And they, they didn't really know. So I made the suggestion, how about we run down your uh, top five best selling models right now? So that's what we're gonna do in this video. Uh, Civivi has just really kind of taken the world but the knife world by storm. They're now in Walmart. They just became available in Walmart, which is which is huge. And um, for those of you that know Civivi, they offer a lot. They offer like hundreds of different models at really affordable price points. Number one, um, for those of you that know Civivi, you probably saw this one coming, but the Elementum. <laughs> I would think that this was probably their best. This has got to be their best selling model of all time. This one that they sent me is the button lock. So that is their top Elementum version right now, but they offered the Elementum in a whole different, a whole line. There's a whole family of Elementums. One of my favorite knives, my favorite ADCs, is this folding Elementum, which I got at Blade Show 2021. It was a special edition. I love this blade so much and yeah one of the variants they came out with is the is the button lock elementum so the elementum is popular for a variety of reasons one it's a great deal and that will be a common theme along this entire video all of this knife runs from like 50 to 60 dollars i think when it first was released in like 2020 it won best buy of the year at blade show 2020 and uh yeah it's it's just also a very comfortable functional design drop point very comfortable in the hand. You can really make this into a workhorse. Here I am just relatively easy slicing through some rubber PVC pipe. This model is $65. If you were to ask me what knife really defines Safivi as a brand, I would probably have to say it's gotta be the Elementum. <laughs> Look at, I just found my, my Elementum Mini. They even make a mini version. Great, you know, EDC blade, really all you need. That is the first top selling. This is probably the most, top selling version of Civivi. So yeah, this is the, the button lock Elementum. The next best selling Civivi knife, and this is an, I think I might've mentioned this, no particular order, is the Cubit. And a lot of people will argue that this is actually uh, better than the Elementum. Uh, this is a bit newer though. One of their, I guess, I think it's been around for around two years. Um, one thing I like about it though, is it's ambidextrous and that makes it immediately accessible to you know, 10 to 12% more of the population. It is um, a very lightweight knife. It is an aluminum handle, super slicey blade. It is relatively thin, but it is just an absolute razor. Oh, they're just measured at 146. I ran this through several times on this sharpness scale. Came out at about an average of anywhere from like 150 to 190, which is very, very sharp. I ran all of these, I ran all of these knives through the best C test and, uh, and Cubit was was the winner. Just so sharp. Oof. Another nice little feature of the Quibit is the bottle opener on it. Just makes it a even that more of a useful item. Very lightweight, comes in a bunch of fun colors if that's your thing. So it's very piercy, very slicey. We also have this nice little uh, kind of like a finger groove, a very generous sharpening choil, right? Kind of pinch up. Uh, your finger there. It's a fantastic EDC blade. The 60 to 75, 80 dollar range. So it is pretty relatively budget friendly. Comes in 14, 28 end steel, which is a great budget steel. Run down on the Quibit button. Quibit, Quibit button lock. Man, it is very fun. Boom! <laughs> it's very snappy. Next up, a very new knife and a recent top seller for Civivi has been the Elementum Utility Blade. Utility blades have been really popular uh, this year. And uh, yeah, Civivi jumped right on that and they did it very well by making it not only a flipper tab, but also a button lock deployment. So if you want a fancy razor blade, well, you can get this one. And it's actually very, it's very reasonable. It's 50 bucks for this. 
And you can also re you can also change out the razor blades, which is very easy to do. It is an aluminum handle, so it's nice and lightweight. Really like how the silver looks all together. So Vivi includes three extra blades, which is a compact size, gonna take up too much room in your pocket. Deep carry reversible pocket clip, so I switched the pocket clip on mine. I don't know how strong that is, but we're gonna see by just kind of giving it some real pressure. I'm just gonna stab that in there really hard and let's bend, bend, bend. It's bending the tip as, as it would because it is literally a razor blade. Okay, we did break the tip, but I'm just realizing I did a crappy job screwing that back on. So just put that in a bit more proper. It's not breaking the bank at $50. I mean, granted a regular box cutter is gonna be better. Woo! There it goes, okay. <laughs> Um, I don't know where that fl Oh my god. Okay, I felt where it went. It's in my hair. It fell in my hair. Oh my god. That's why you wear safety glasses, because stuff flies when you're doing that. <laughs> okay, well, luckily, it's really easy to change back in. Yeah, this thing, this thing is cool. Uh, <laughs> uh, but just don't, you know, don't push down as hard as you possibly can while prying in the opposite direction because it is, it still is a razor blade. And razor blades are thin, and uh, that will that will break them. And that button lock is kind of, it's designed with a little spring underneath that button to provide just the right amount of tension so that button's not going to go off inside your pocket. But yeah, new one from Civivi that has been a very hot one for them. I feel really bad because I scared Delilah. She like got up and ran. It's okay, it's okay. The little girl, she's 16 years old. Everything scares her right now. Next up on the list, we have two more left, is the Civivi Mini Praxis. And this is only 30 to $35, which is definitely one of the reasons this is one of Civivi's top selling blades. Smaller version of the Praxis. This one weighs 2.6 pounds, $30 price point. This is a, it's a true budget knife. It doesn't feel, this doesn't feel like a $30 knife. Um, we have machining to make it a little swedged out so it gets thin right here. It's going to be piercy, it's jimping right here, and it's just it's just a comfortable, more, I wouldn't really call this a compact, it's just compact compared to the regular Praxis from Civivi. A lot of protection here when you're holding this. Your hand is not going to slide upward. Good EDC task folder and one that you can beat around because it's 30 bucks and you're not going to feel as bad beating the crap out of it deep carry pocket clip that we see very often on all the popular Civivi models. It goes in your pocket, it's low profile, and it's not screaming, hey, I have a knife on me. Yeah, that's the mini, <laughs> that's the mini Praxis for you. The most affordable of these, of the bunch, so. Um, have you guys guessed any of the ones on this list? If so, good job. Um, this next one is uh, one probably that I'm the most excited about, and that is the Vision. Actually, it's called no, the Vision FG. And uh, this one is a really exciting, it's, it's a bit different than these other ones because this one has the uh, Snack 10 or Snacks uh, Super Lock here that we pull down on this lever right here, and then that thing shuts. This thing is super duper fidgety, and you can get this under $100, which is pretty amazing. So this is the spacer that we're pushing down on. Here's the spring providing tension right now. I'm gonna hold that spring in place, and when we press down on that back spacer, it allows the tang freedom to move out and deploy. So darn cool. The opening and closing or fidget factor of it reminds me of, of a shark lock and feel, though it is actually functionally or mechanical wise, it is much different than this is one of those knives that once you buy, you will just constantly take it out of your pocket to fidget with. It is too fun. It is just a, such a fan. Oops. It is such a fantastic blade and it is ambidextrous. Thank you. It's a great back pocket carry because the way that pocket clip is oriented on the blade or on the, on the handle an overall length of just under eight inches so it is a it is a slightly larger edc blade 
Everything about this knife is awesome. I love this. Just a super cool locking mechanism. The blade feels solid. The construction feels good. And you also have the holes going through the liner and the scales, which is going to offer a little bit of a weight reduction because it is a beefier blade at like 4.3 ounces. It is no mystery why they are selling a ton of these. Yeah, that is that is number five on the top selling Civivis right now. There you have it. The top five selling Civivi knives right now. I will make sure to link all of those below, which will be uh, affiliate links to help support my channel. And if you are interested in buying any of those, do it during Civivi's National Knife Day celebration. Any purchases over $29, you get this really cool free morale patch. It's like an $8 patch. So it's a fun little freebie that you can get if you purchase any of those knives used, uh, purchase any of those knives through the links I provide below. And also I'll be giving away some of these Civivi knives on my WhatNot live stream. I will link that below. My next live stream on WhatNot is happening uh, August 28th. So hopefully I'll see you see you there. Oh, and like I said, don't forget to check out Civivi in Walmart now, which is so crazy that they're gonna be in Walmart. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know below if there are any other brands that you would like to see the top uh, five models. I thought this was kind of a fun little video idea and I hope to do it with some more brands. So thank you all so so much for watching. I hope that your summer is going safe and happy. And I, uh, as always, really appreciate the love and support on this channel. You're just all very amazing. Thank you to Civivi for making this video possible. And you all have a fabulous, fabulous week, weekend, whatever time of the day, week it is for you. Okay, bye guys.